What's going on YouTube do-it-yourselfers? My name is Tom and I am the owner of TriGen Appliance Repair and third generation appliance repair technician. The other day I had the privilege of working on one of these newer Samsung Flex washers and I replaced the main PCB circuit board in the back. First thing you're going to do is remove a couple screws that hold the cover. Once those screws are removed, you will be able to take the cover off and that will reveal the board. It is actually inside of a white housing and the top of this housing is actually connected to the board itself. There's three screws that hold that housing down. Once you have those removed, obviously you can pop that top half of the cover up and the board is actually connected to the bottom of it. There's a few plugs that go into the board obviously and don't worry about worrying where they go because they only can plug into the slot they fit into. Once you have all those removed, you can get the new board and start plugging it back in. If for some reason you're still watching this, I applaud you because obviously you're just going to put the board back down, put the three screws back in, I even counted them out for you guys. If you paid close attention you'll notice that I started with one, two, three when they were removing and when I reinstall them I start with three, two, one. I thought that was kind of clever. So now that the board is back in you can put the cover back over the top one thing that was kind of tricky on this was the drain hose in the back it has like a security torx fastener in it so I just kind of had to slide the, the hose enough to get slack to get the cover up enough to access the board so if you found this video to be of value feel free to leave a donation equal to the value of this video my paypal and venmo links are always in the description below Thanks for watching and take care.